Hello now there, everybody. We're back with some more Super Auto Pets right here, right now. I am ready. This is a great shop. I'll just say that much. Let's try one of these. Yeah, uh, back to my Super Auto Pets. I always have a great time with this game, so we're gonna play some more. I mean, I played some yesterday. And, uh, oh, maybe that's not what we want to get the buff? I don't know, because I feel like we kind of wanted to kill that later. But whatever. Let's go with, uh, let's go with this. We'll be the... The Shy Seeds. I like that one. We're gonna see what we can get up to. Uh, in this fine... Hang on, what day is it today? Oh, dude, what are you doing? What are you doing? Wednesday, November 17th. Sorry, whenever I look down, I close my eyes. Notice the first episode that I was spending half of it with my eyes closed. That's okay. This is an awful shop, so we're gonna immediately roll it. And then we're gonna go for this, and I guess... We could roll again. But I kind of... Maybe we should. Maybe we should roll again, because then what am I going to do with these? You know, I actually usually don't employ the duck strategy. Because the duck is just awful. <clears throat> but I'm thinking what we could possibly get here in terms of uh, items. And I'm thinking next time we roll, we could probably get an apple. Not going to buy an apple. Uh, and if we roll, we can't buy two animals anyway. So I'm probably just going to buy the duck. Then roll. And then sell the duck. And then I guess we could put the cricket. Let's put the cricket here. And I think I think I like how that looks. I mean, the cricket isn't ideal, but it's pretty good. It, well, it's decent. It's a decent. It'll get stuff done. I don't foresee a way that we could lose. I mean, this is gonna be pretty tough to beat. But the the. Oh man, you you, you would want to snipe the the ant there. But the the fish here are gonna make it a little bit tough. Oh no! no wait, never mind. Wait. Yeah, we do win. We do win. That's easy. Easy wins, easy wins. You'll have to see it. Okay, tier two animals. So, let's think about this for a second. Uh, we could potentially buff the mosquito. I don't know if I feel like doing that necessarily. I don't want, I don't necessarily want to roll mosquito long turn, so I'm going to roll. Okay, swan is a good get. And uh, let's, uh, hang on. Hold up, hold up. I don't know what I want to buff permanently because I feel like I'm going to get rid of everything. So for now, I'm just going to level it up because the ant is the most likely thing to stay. We've got swan. Swan is good. Good stats. Um, let's go ahead and toss. Uh, well, I'm thinking like just for pure stats, right? You could probably... You could probably get rid of... The otter, because it's level one. And then put the elephant back here. Roll. And then you get another mosquito. And then you get an otter, which kind of is very upsetting. But we got a crab here. We really can't make that work yet. I'm kind of thinking that we're looking a little weak this turn. So... I'm going to... I'll use a cupcake on you. Just to try and guarantee a win. I was about to say, I hope they don't have a scorpion at the front. They cannot have a scorpion at the front. And right here, we're looking at the weakest squad in the world. I mean, we our, our ant just went through, like, most of the squad there. Hang on. Yeah, yeah, we win that one. Easy, easy wins, easy wins. I gotta remember to look down, because anytime that I just kind of gaze down, it, uh... It makes me close close my eyes. Okay, so... I mean, the cricket's pretty good. It has better stats than the mosquito. The mosquito does do one damage. But I don't think that's necessarily useful right now. So I'm going to buy an otter. Just for the buff. Hope I get a buff on the swan or the ant. Because that's probably what I'm going to keep. <sighs> yes. Okay, and then we're going to freeze this. The reason why I'm freezing this is because next turn we should be unlocking another tier. And I do want to level up my ant. And I'm not really interested in either of these. I guess you could buy... I want to level up the ant so that we can get a... Uh... So that we can get an, uh, the next tier of animal. Let's roll. Okay, we got two ants. Man, that kind of sucks now. I guess we could, uh, at this point, we could probably once again get rid of the otter and get another ant. And roll again. Nope, roll again. 
Okay, so we got we got some good stuff going on here with the ant. I don't know if we could roll this late game. It's way too late for the fish. Fish just does not have stats to keep up with the kind of heat that we're dealing with now. Uh, that's awful. I I don't think we're gonna win this one just because of the the swan with the meat there. But their back line is quite weak. Uh, actually, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, wait, nah, we lose. We do lose. This is the one case in the universe that the horse has ever won a match. K dear lord. Okay, let's do this and see what we get. Squirrel is awful. So instead, let's do this. And do just join it up. Do this. I'm ready for my next promotion. But I feel like, I think it's a little too early to start worrying about that, huh? Did I just keep buffing? Hope we get a better unit. Or maybe I should I should probably roll because I don't think like I don't I don't feel like we have anything for the future. Another swan is good. Another otter, but like the otter, the otter's gone. Man, this is this is rough because we could totally no we could totally run swan. I think. Let's uh let's do this and this and roll once. Okay, two swans is good enough. Yeah. Oh, not enough gold, of course. I, I'm trying to use resources, which I do not currently have. That is problematic. Man, I don't feel confident in this squad at all. We could have maybe run, mos uh, not Mosquito, uh, flamingo, pe flamingo Pill, but this is a good trade at the start. We don't get sniped, yeah? No, we don't get sniped. Oh, but this is this is bad, though. Yeah, we, we lose this, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, we lose because they, they... The spider. Hang on, hang on. We can make this work still. We can make this work. Okay, let's do this. Okay, we get penguin. Penguin is actually not too bad. It's not my, not my first choice. Okay, this has to go. It's not my first choice. If I had any, any, any sort of... Any sort of, uh... Any sort of control over it wouldn't be what I would decide to do, but... And we're gonna run... I'm trying to think, because... If we do give the, 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 the ant the meat bone, and then we put the penguin back there, we're only gonna have four? I feel like the penguin has to happen, because we need to get some sort of, uh, scaling unit. But then what could we replace at the back? I think, I think maybe you just go like this. And then like, like th this? No, like this? I don't know, dude, this is bad because we don't really have what I'm looking for. I mean, it's way too late to start a dog, I feel. So I don't know, I guess we just do this and hope that we get lucky and the next team, the next squad isn't too strong. There's a garlic armor fish right there, which is scaring the hell. Oh my god, never mind. We just destroyed it. And we can pretty pretty easily uh, plow through the rest of this team. Okay. I mean, that works for me. And we got tier 4 animals. I think it's about time we do give you garlic armor. But then there's, the, there's a turtle right there, though. Man. Uh, the bison could potentially work, but... I'm going to freeze it and then roll. I need an ant is the thing. This is not going to, this is not going to scale. So I'm trying to think like, is this really worth it? I kind of think like we just go hard on the rolling. I, I do feel like can, a can is good right now because our team is just in the state of like, like, we don't know what we're doing, really. I mean, I never know what I'm doing in this game. Hippo could potentially work, actually. For now, I'm going to put the... I, we need to get rid of this elephant, like, ASAP. But at least we got a decently strong bison there now. And we have garlic armor on our swan, and we are scaling. But I don't think we're going fast enough for this. I don't think I don't think this is going to really get it done. Okay, we killed the... Hang on, hang on. We, we destroyed their front line. Okay, we do win this. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Yeah, we win this one as well. 
Bison's chilling in the back. We're at five, I believe. Five. Uh, Penguin is looking a little tempting there. You know what? Let's do this. Just because I'm scared of running into crabs. And then... Oh, man. But then there's a hippo. Are we going too hard on this... Uh, oh, dude. The monkey, though. Hang on. Hang on a second. The monkey is so tempting. Because you could make a hippo work right here. Do we have enough to make it work? We don't. We don't because we can't buy the monkey, the hippo, and the garlic on the same turn. Not that it necessarily needs garlic, but it would be nice. Okay, let's let's restructure a little bit. We're going to have to figure out how to make this work. But I'm, I have a feeling we can make it. Okay, bison, I think is too much. We're not going to make it work. Let's instead do this. Put the stronger unit up front. And I feel like now, this is not great, right? Because this is unprotected, but might be able to, okay, ant, very important because next turn is when we unlock new units, I believe. This is also very important. I'm just gonna freeze the entire shop and, and not let it roll over the next turn. Okay, th this one's gonna be a little, little touch and go, but we are scaling the units up front. I feel like we're too weak though for where we are now. Let's have a look. That's the strongest dog I've ever seen. I should have kept the skunk. The skunk would have been great right here. But maybe Oh no. No, it's over. It's over. Okay, okay. We have we have one more to turn 9 right there. And then watch this. Hit that. Hit this. Oh, maybe we should have... Oh, dude. The hippo? I know that... Oh, wait. We could just do it like this. And then we get mammoth. Nobody cares. And let's just do this. And I... Look, double mammoth, by the way. Awful. I know that this is not necessarily fantastic, but I think our, our penguin's going to buff everybody now, even though it's only plus one, plus one. And now we just kind of pray that we don't get taken out this turn. That is scary. That is the weakest crab in the universe. But, hey, look, our hippo's going to get a lot of buff. Uh, oh, I think we win this one. I don't think there's any way in which we lose this round. Okay, we got quite lucky there. We're at six wins. It's above above five. That's all I can ask for, really. And what are we looking for here? I'm looking to either replace or level up the penguin at this moment. Or get a better scaling unit. Dragon would be nice. Nothing here really calls to me. Maybe I should put the ant up front. It's a little strange. No, because then it'll get buffed by the monkey. Maybe we should get rid of the ant. I mean, the bison is a good replacement. Oh, dude. I'm trying to think. Because I think one penguin, one level two penguin is better than one level one monkey. Let's do this. And roll again. Okay. We did get this. Let's buff you this is strange i don't usually i wouldn't usually go for penguin over monkey but i feel like it's actually better here and let's buff you up so now we're, we're doing this we're, we're just doing uh casual sap strats where you uh you just kind of buff one unit and you're done with it okay we, could, we can roll for now bison would be nice because that way it actually gets buffed by a penguin that bison, yeah. And then this, and the next turn we can have a turn a uh, uh, level two bison, and that should scale pretty nicely. I feel decently confident, but also I'm scared about meeting something like this. But it didn't matter there. And then the shrimp gets buffed, and then that. Okay, we win this one. We win this one as well. It's looking great. I, th I think we're having a great run right now. Okay, so quickly. This has to happen. And then fly. Doesn't matter. We're not going for fly. This is not the kind of build that we're looking for. Um, I'm going to roll because, once again, if I buy something from this shop, I'm not going to have the option to buy... some. If I if I buy something now and I re-roll, I'm not going to be able to buy anything from that re-roll. So I'm just going to re-roll now and choose to buy something from any future shops instead of that one. 
And then we roll again. Splash attack is, is interesting. I will freeze this. Rooster is interesting as well, but I feel like it's just too late. Okay, let's just let's just give him salad and hope that we can make this work. I mean that that bison is getting really strong. We need to give garlic. We need to defend that bison somehow. Maybe it's about time we start switching to melon armor. I don't know. We'll see. Anyway, dog at the front is a little scary, but oh, dude, they had they had tiger skunk. That is nasty. Wait, we do win. We're two wins away from ten again. Hey, you can't win them all. I'm not expecting to win every game I play, but. Feels nice to have this uh to have to to have what we got going on now. Hmm. I'm trying to think, like is it really worth leveling up the bison again? I'm not sure. I don't think so. Let's do this. Oh, okay, melon. We do you have melon armor? I feel like we should melon armor the hippo. I do know that this leaves our ox still exposed, but like, I do think it's crucial that the the hippo gets melon armor. <laughs> that way, if we meet something strong at the front, like a like a scorpion, it would need to have over twenty damage in order to to one shot our hippo. That is the world's strongest fucking dog. Oh my god! But their back line doesn't seem too strong, so hopefully now, no, dude, it's over. We need better. Do we do we get to play one more? No, we got knocked out. All right, we could do we could do one more. We, we could we could manage one more. Okay, otter, dude, this is looking great. Hang on. Uh, do we should we should we risk getting something worse than a cricket? The cricket is not my ideal choice, but the otters do need something to buff. I'm just gonna go. I'm just gonna do it like this. I know that I have two otters. Which is maybe... That's a bad idea, actually. I don't know why I did it like that. We could have gotten a fish. But, like, you can't... The sour underdogs. You can't live your life thinking, like... Oh, your life should not be composed entirely of what, what could-haves. You, you have to think about what is in the moment. Um, we win this, I'm pretty sure. It's looking good. Also, you don't want to do this with the otter. Well, I guess it depends on how your capacity is doing. You don't want to you don't want to buy them both individually. This looks pretty good, dude. Um, okay. You drive a hard bargain, but I'll bite. Let's try this. I don't even know if this is really that great up front. Let's try something like that. Because our, our strongest unit right now is the otter. So it's not going up front. Here, let's... It's a little strange, but let's try it like this. I guess. Next turn we're gonna get tier two units. I'm excited about that. Yeah, so that way we check out their flamingo and then the fish does die. Not not to this one. Not to this one. Oh, we lose, we lose, we actually lose. Damn. I do think we died entirely. I do think we 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 uh lost that one entirely due to uh what do you how do you how do you call it? The ant RNG. Man, that is not where I wanted the buff. That is upsetting. That's very upsetting. Let's, uh... Oh, do dog? It's early enough for a dog. I do think that it is early enough for a dog. Okay, so anything we buy... Ooh, sorry. Voice crack. Anything we buy, we now have to... Play onto the board. Not just give it to one of our... Uh, not just place it on top of a currently existing unit. So let's sell this. Buy the spider. Spider can be actual shit, but I kind of feel like it might be better than a cricket. It 100% is better than a cricket, right? I don't know. I'm not too confident in the squad right now. This might be this this is gonna be this is gonna be a little hard right here. Okay, so we got spider in the front, then followed by an ox. The ox scares the shit out of me. But we can destroy the armor like this, kill this. No, we lose. Unless, no, wait, we got whale. No, we, we definitely lose. Man, just not, not, not having good luck here. At least that's not the end of our run. Purely because, uh, because of the way the, the levels work now. I'm seeing, and look, I see the spider. I see the spider and I understand. 
But like, I don't really respect the spider. So I'm going to be totally honest with you. I do feel like we can start thinking about getting rid of this fish. Do we want to get rid of the fish or the spider? I'm getting rid of the fish. Look, that might be a uh, that might be an option, uh, a a a choice that gets me in trouble, but so be it. Okay, so once again, we've ended up buffing the we've been, we've ended up buffing an ant into the stratosphere, but that that's you know that's just what happens. Uh, damn, I wish I could have bought cupcake. Next turn, we could probably pill this, but it really depends on how the rest of our squad is looking. This giraffe is not sticking around. Giraffe is not good. What are we looking at here? Oh, big fish. Big fish at the front. And uh, this, then a horse back there for some reason. The horse is going to run into some issues when it hits our dog, but that, you know, that's how it is. That's what, that's the squad doing really what it was intended to do. Okay. Um, let's get rid of the spider for a swan hang on freeze this then you roll the garlic is tempting especially on the dog the dog is not super strong yet but i do think it might be the way to go i don't know if it's the way to i don't know if that's what you want to do now but do it like this i feel like look the swan is a better purchase than the spider because the spider could spawn so many, so much, like a bunch of weaker stuff. It could spawn like a snail 2-2. Two, two. This at least has guaranteed 4 HP. So I feel like it might be able to do more work. Maybe that's wrong. And if, if, if that's the case, then so be it. Man, this. Ah, oh, shit. I'm, I'm trying to think. I'm trying to think right here. I do think we want to keep the giraffe. We do miss one buff by doing this, but it does give us 1-1 one, one anyway, which is better. Well, no, we could have gotten... 2-1 or 1-2 by actually spawning it onto the field, but I don't think we had the capacity for it. So let's just do this instead. It's a little scary right now. Oh, we find our place. Maybe I should have frozen that kangaroo, by the way. I won't deny that. Okay. Pufferfish does not scare me whatsoever. And now we... Hang on. We go on a tear with our dog. Okay. That's good. That's good. That's looking good. Swan could potentially level up, but I do think... <clears throat> sorry, my voice cracked. I, I just hit puberty yesterday. I do think it's about time that we think about getting rid of one of these. And I do think it's this, because just playing the rabbit is going to buff the dog. Now, that... that I, I, I am 100% okay with admitting might have been a, a misplay, but I'm just trying to get the otter to work, but I don't think it's going to work, and I think it's actually going to end up harming me to not get rid of it quicker. Hmm. Because right now we have the rabbit, so we should be, like, buffing the shit out of it, you know? Buffing the shit out of our dog for HP. Uh, yeah, the otter can probably go. Here, let's, let's try and find a replacement. Let, let's just do this. Let's just do this. And then I'm actually going to... Hmm, should I sell it? Should I sell the swan here? I'm trying to think. Let's let's roll one more time. I think you keep it for this turn. Next turn we're going to be pretty strong. The ant, you know, some there's a there's an argument to be made for this kind of configuration, but I wonder if maybe this I, I'm trying to think, right? Cuz if we put this over here, it's definitely going to buff one of these and these are like worth nothing. So how can we make the best out of this? We don't want to front load it with our weaker units because that's just not how you play this game. What if they have a hippo? Then we end up biting the dust. So maybe this is the desired configuration, but then the uh, on the off chance, there's a 25% chance it'll hit our dog and buff it for four, uh, plus four, plus two. Let's just have a little look around the shop really quick. Um, we're we're going to keep the sleeping pill because we're probably going to pill the, the ant next turn. Unless we can't find a suitable replacement. Let's hope that the, the ant's buff hits her dog. Oh my god, look at that fish. Okay, we do lose here, pretty sure. Yeah, we do lose. Hang on. Hang on a second. 
It's not the end. It's not the end. We can we can make this work. Let's uh Let's do this. Okay, that's not that's not what I wanted to get that, but it's fine. Uh I don't I think we need something to replace that. I know that we could buy the rabbit and actually we will. But we need to get rid of one of the swans. Okay, that's a perfect replacement for the swan. I do not mind that whatsoever. We could get a level 2 rabbit here and then cupcake. No, no, no. Let's do this. Let's do this first. I think this is more important. Um, And since we're not going to use the rabbits this turn anyway, I kind of feel like we should do this and then get a rooster, another rooster. And pop it over here. Freeze the rabbit. The rabbit's pretty strong, honestly, at this point. I feel like maybe we should have it here. Kind of front load the team a little bit, but... I mean, that's kind of how you run this. Hippo's very good as well. Let's keep it like this. Um, we're, never, we're not going to get a uh, level 3 unit anytime soon, but I'm not too confident about this. This could be the end. This could be the end of our runs. <clears throat> Oops, didn't mean for it to go this fast. They got a little bit of a whale build over here. It's the weakest the weakest dog in the universe. I don't, I'm not too scared of the squad, honestly. Yeah, because we can just destroy it. Okay, we got lucky, I feel. We, we, we should be grateful to be alive at this point. Um, let's begin by doing this. And then this. We got Parrot. Nobody cares. I'm going to be real with you. Just nobody cares. It's just how it is. So, we could either roll for another tier 5 by combining the swan. Or we could hold this until next turn. Do I want to run Hippo, though? Hang on. Hold up. Let's put this... This swan is quite weak. I'm only saving it for the level up so we get a tier 6 next turn. That could be game changing. We could get Dragon. We could get, like, Sauropod. No one's going to run Sauropod. But then... I'm trying to think. I mean, the Crab is pretty great here, but it's only, it's only got 3 attack. So I'm trying to think, like, it's not really worth it, is it? I do think salad might be nice, but not not being able to choose what goes to is a little scary because it could buff either either the either of these two, and I really don't want that right now. So, hmm, uh, I can we afford to die one more time? I don't know. We're go we're just gonna do this, and oh, dude, that was well worth it. Hang on. Now I think we we start buffing the the rooster. Oh, dude, that that's going that's going hard. Okay, I'm starting to feel a little bit better about this. Um, and then I guess we could go for this. Hey, oh man, uh, uh, I'm trying to think. Well, there's no benefit to bringing the hippo now, so I guess our best choice is to do this. But, like, that's a little bit scary. I, I don't know what the crab is going to really be doing in that spot that it's in right now. Okay, they got worms. We have a chance of winning against the squad. And, in fact, it, it is looking good. Yeah, we win. We win that one pretty easily as well. I just want to get to above five. That's the, that's the goal every time. Anything above five is good. Um, let's give you that. It'll buff your, your HP, which really doesn't matter at this point. And I'm thinking, like... I did level up the swan last turn, because I thought that would have been help, more helpful for this turn. Turns out I was dead wrong. But, you know, it happens. Salad, you know, I'm just going to go salad. I'm just going to go boss to the wall. Oh, dude. That is actually the best things it could have hit. Could have hit right there. So, turkey... It has no space in this current build, but it's pretty good. I'm trying to think right now. We could do something like... If we do that, it's going to buff... Let's freeze this. We're not bringing the hippo. It's just this is how it's going to be. Kangaroo is pretty decent, actually, but... What will this what will this do for us? It'll actually turn our 915 rooster into what is essentially a 
24 16 spread across two different hits i don't think that's worth it i think this because of the permanent buff is good i don't know dude we might we might lose here look i just want to get six wins that's all i want i just want six wins let's see how's it looking okay we take out their hippo and then their kangaroo takes our okay hang on this is looking good. This is looking good. Okay. Whew. We got six wins. That's all I can ask for. The rest is just bonus. From here on out, it's just bonus. Okay. Um, let's get rid of the swan. We're going to do a little bit of... No, that's, that's, that's very wasteful. Let's do this. Now, I know that... Oh, hang on. Dude, okay. Hang, hold up, hold up. We can make some great stuff happen here. We can give, we can get early melon armor to our dog. And then I guess we could just pop a mammoth at the front. And hope that that was a good choice. It was a pretty fast turn. It's a little scary. I'm looking at trying to replace the rabbit tune. Oh god, this person has a background. You know that they're out of control. It, oh, that's a level two rooster as well. We do take out one of the chicks. Nah, dude, we, we, we win. We, wait, yeah, we win, we win. Okay, it's looking good, it's looking good. We're at seven wins, we're at seven wins. Seven wins is what we're at. Okay. Um. I, I would like to get rid of the mammoth, I'm not gonna lie to you. The mammoth does not interest me at all, having it on this particular squad. We're gonna look for a replacement right now. <sighs> Penguin, huh? Penguin's interesting, but... Let's get rid of the mammoth now. I guess... Oh, we could have pilled it, huh? For permanent plus two plus two. That was a misplay. Oops. Let's do this. Just for the the extra HP from the rabbit, which I guess maybe we shouldn't have done because it doesn't really benefit our, uh, our rooster to have more HP, but that's fine. Rhino. Rhino's interesting. I've never made the rhino work. I'm just scared shitless of running into a a hippo at the front as we are now. Because this is just way too weak. It will not survive a hippo attack. There's a fly. There's We can't make the fly work in this particular build, though. It's the thing. It, that's the thing, you know? It can't work. We could melon armor the rooster. And then we'd be running four... We'd be running four animals. Now, there's a problem with four animals. It's not necessarily that it would be worse. We do need to get rid of this rabbit, like, soon. It's not necessarily that it would be inherently worse. I mean, you stand to have less stats on your team by just having less less t uh, friends, teammates, animals. The problem with it as well, that a lot of people would not consider... Ooh, this is... This is, uh... They're gonna attack our rooster. That's fine. That's where we put melon armor on it. Oh, no. Hang on. Oh, no. We win. We win. Yeah. So the problem with having less squad members is that if they have a, a something like a dolphin, it has more of a chance of targeting something that you might care about. Let's go for this. Just so we have the, the tier two right there. And then uh, there's no level three friends, so we can't make that work. I don't know how to slot the, the hippo into this current build right now. I kind of feel like this is worth it just because we're, we are in this kind of flux right now. And I do think that you could roll one. Here's the thing. We could roll one. This will sell for two gold, right? So we could roll one and we could stand to roll twice, actually. Man, that's not good enough. I feel like for now, just putting this, this is pretty good right here because it will get two buffs, but it, it's a little weak for the for where we are in the game right now. I'm not going to lie. I, I don't see us making it much further. I mean, look at this thing. What is this? We don't get rid of it. Even with our crab, it's going to go through our entire line. Like, look at this. I think I think this is this. This is it. I think we've lost. Oh, wait. We're still alive. We got one more life to work with. Dude, dragon. Okay, get out of here. 
and you must also leave. Something to be said though about cat. <laughs> this will be plus four, plus four. I don't know. Let's let's do this. I'm going hard on the dragon just because I'm scared. I'll be real with you. I'm scared. I'm just gonna do dragon strats. Oh no. Give us a tier one, you son of a bitch. Double oh dude. Look, this is kind of silly. But also, I'm really interested in this tiger. Here we got a tier one. God, this is this this would be funny to put behind the uh, put behind the rooster. This tiger. Um, I I think I won last game like that last video I made. Okay, let's see this. I don't have much. I don't have much faith that this is going to be a win. We we might lose it right here. I mean, it is looking bad. Looking at their front line. And just their 3442 dog. And this is a turkey fly build, I just realized. Holy shit. Yeah, this is this is for sure a loss. Because that alone takes out one of our chicks. But you know what? Hey, I think we put up a good fight, and uh, you can't win them all, right? So. Uh, whatever. We still get our lovely, lovely currency 55. Let's go, baby. But yeah, that's going to be it for this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate your viewership and your support. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe if you did enjoy the video. And uh, yeah, I'm going to get the fuck up out. Thank you guys so much. Uh, remember to do all that lovey-dovey bullshit. Social media links are in the description. Bye-bye.